Hello, welcome everyone. And in this video, I like to show you. I would like to show you a development board I bought from uh, Micro Electronica, and it is a development board for DS Peak uh, microcontrollers. The reason I bought this because uh, DS Peak microcontrollers can do some digital signal processing, and uh, yeah, I'm not very good at it, but when I learn, I'm gonna make some tutorials like for big microcontrollers, uh, the usual 8-bit one, and these are, um, you know, 16-bit uh, microcontrollers, so uh, yeah, it's a really nice board. Uh, here is the DSPIC 30F4013, and uh, I don't know what's special about that, uh, in particular, uh, it says it's for motor control, but Microelectronica made uh, some good books uh, and with this particular micro DSP microcontroller and two more. And you know, that's why the reason one of the reasons I bought it so I would learn to program DSP microcontrollers. Okay, now here I have a, a GLCD module. Uh, sockets and headers over here I can use uh, for touch panel and also I can use for a TFT board so TFT boards are very good they, they can display colors here I have the touch panel controller and here are the usual pins uh, here I have the LCD 2 uh, times 16 um, I have some sand segment displays over here here I have a piezo buzzer, which I can generate some sounds. Uh, the out, uh, input output ports with uh, push buttons are over here. What I don't see over here are the... Oh no, no, it's okay. They are... I think... I, I'm not sure are these LEDs or what. But, you know, I, here is the user manual so I can see everything about this particular development board. So this is called Easy Pick version 7 for DS Pick uh, 30. But I don't need uh, LEDs, LEDs are just you know for but I think these are yeah these are the LEDs so sorry yeah these are the LEDs these white white uh, rectangles here are LEDs. Now what is uh, great about this uh, in particular is that it has uh, micro bus sockets over here so I can put some click boards over here and you know if you don't know what what are click boards go to micro electronica site it's really great and I can buy a lot of click click boards uh, and uh, I can program various with various sensors, uh, memory cards, etc. Now this particular microcontroller has a CAN communication. I don't need, a, uh, I think I don't need any module for that. I'm not sure, but, or maybe I do. Yeah, I see here MCP255Y, but uh, so that means I have to use CAN SPY library for that. Uh, I, ha I can put an e external ICD over here. Uh, I don't know, but these are some socket selections. Oh yeah, that's for uh, which microcontroller here I'm going to use because you can uh, use uh, I don't know some are 28 pins, some are 18 pins, 28 deep 40A, deep 40B. So yeah, I change it. I change the socket over here. I guess. Uh, my, this is the micro prog uh, programmer. It is programmed uh, with uh, USB. Um, here I can select if I want a 3.3 volt or 5 volt operating voltage for the microcontroller. This particular uh, works uh, on both of those voltages. So that is a logical high for them. Okay, now what I see here is I think this is RS232 uh, connector over here. Uh, I have an USB uh, connector over here, port over here, 
with uh, UART communication and uh, yeah, uh, 7 second displays, I already told that uh, that's basically it well, uh, this is uh, the most fun for me because now in the future I can uh, spend less money uh, just for the click boards I wanted to buy uh, the development board from the 7th generation because uh, I can use click boards and uh, yeah I don't I and I can do a lot of cool stuff uh, over here I have some i2c EEPROM uh, memory uh, I have an ADC input for the microcontroller over here these potentiometers uh, here and here are for the LCD and uh, graphical LCD contrast and that's basically it and I, I think I have here some uh, input output ports and the touch panel controller so uh, yeah I'll I'll l uh, learn a, a little about this program it a little bit use uh, DSP uh, engines for this bike mic uh, microcontroller read books about this uh, development board and I hope I will make some tutorials on my YouTube channel and yeah, I, I have this user manuals. I think I, I yeah, oh, sorry. I see I have some CDs with some examples, and uh, yeah, you can uh, learn a little. You can uh, see this on Microelectronica's uh, site. So thanks for watching, and see you in my next video. Goodbye.